of the ocean. Tonight, you're going to get to see some people perform. A little earlier in the cruise, we had uh, an audition. We gave you the chance to sing, and your fellow guests chose who was going to make it through to this evening's final. The finalists have been chosen. They practiced, and tonight they're going to be singing for you, our Regal Princess audience, on this stage, backed by this fantastic band. Evening's going to break down. In a moment, I'm going to welcome onto the stage the three coaches. At the moment, the chairs are facing this way. We'll meet, we'll meet each of them. We'll find out what their game plan is. Once we've got them onto the stage, we will turn around. That's you. We will turn around <laughs> their chairs so they face out to the audience. What they won't be able to see is tonight's singers. Then we will introduce each singer individually. If the coach likes the performance, they can hit the button on the front of their chair, their chair will rotate around 180 degrees and they will see who the person is singing. They've shown their interest in that person. Once the person's home, I'll find out what their name is, where they're from, and then the coach will tell them why they think they should join the team. Once every coach has given their bid, it's up to the singer to decide which coach they would like to collaborate with. Once all of the singers have performed, we will then go to the coaches and we will ask them to make the very difficult decision of choosing just one of their singers to go through to the final. Once we've done that, we'll give you a little reminder of their performance, then we will hand it over to you, the audience, who will make the decision as to who is crowned the voice of the ocean here on board the Regal Princess. If you didn't pick up your device yet, maybe you've got a very quick chance to get it, but we'll all turn the lights and you'll be able to see it, it's fantastic. Are you ready to meet the coaches? Yeah. Yeah. All right, welcome out the first one. A wonderful entertainer, please give it up for Grandpa himself, Gary Delena! She's beautiful, she's talented, she's going to be performing in a piazza for you this evening. You saw it in Bravo, the beautiful Chelsea Coyne! And last but not least, we always like to have an officer in the show. Tonight we've got a man with a great personality. He comes from the United Kingdom. He's one of the third officers on the bridge. Give it up for Alfie! <laughs> Welcome to the coaches. How are you doing, guys? Fantastic. Nice to have you here, Alfie. Good on you. Welcome. Now let's go across to Gary of the Lane, which is what I think your name means in English. Gary Delena. Of yes. the lane. Yes, Gary of the lane. That's yes. Exactly now, this isn't your first time doing this, Gary. No, no. Um, after my parole ended, I, uh, I started <laughs> coaching again. Yes. yes. Yeah. Now, I think officially you're the oldest ever coach on any voice <laughs> anywhere in the world. I think, actually, I think the Vietnamese Methuselah in, uh, in the country. <laughs> yes. Will you recognize some of these modern songs by Elvis and people I'll like that? I'll tell you what, if we have any El Jolson material, I'm a so good to go. <laughs> do you have a game plan? Um, I do, I do. I'm gonna... Can you remember it? Yeah, sure. I'm gonna bribe, <laughs> I'm gonna bribe everybody I know. Okay, perfect. We like that. We like that. Chelsea Coin. Now, Gary, you do sing a little bit. I do. It isn't great, but you do. No, I just warble. I think warble is the word you're looking for. Well, listen, I tried it earlier this cruise. No, it wasn't. You did very good. I, I, I was a cheat. Oh, I was a cheat. I was so nervous. But talking about somebody who never gets nervous, who performs magnificently whenever she gets the opportunity, whether she's singing something we all recognize, something a little bit deeper from the Traviata. What a beautiful piece that was. The very talented, the wonderful <coughs> Chelsea Coyne. Thank you, Mark. Yes. Oh, that's a nice intro. Now look, you are fantastic at this. You win it very regularly. You always seem to know what to listen to, what to look for. Can you beat the two boys tonight? Oh yeah. Easy. <laughs> no. Let's just go to the end. You know? Really? I feel sorry for these guys. Just go yeah. for that. Simple. Yeah. Now you're from Fort Worth, Texas. Not a lot of opera singers from Fort Worth, I don't think. Yeah, sure. Okay. None of them are you though, right? No. Just you. Just me. We like that. Yes. Alfie, 
Absolutely. Talk about being thrown into the deep end. Absolutely. What the heck were we thinking? <laughs> I gotta tell you, Alfie's got his Martin part on board this cruise. They've been actually been on the last I think they've been here since he's been about 13 on board the ship actually. Yeah, two months. Uh, you work on the bridge, you do a fantastic job, you've found every island that we aim for this cruise. Well done. Congratulations on behalf of all of us. And you found some sun. I did. Yes. Yeah, you did a great job. You know nothing about singing, I'm guessing. Very little. Yes. Very little. And you're in, a, as a coach, in a singing competition. Oh, is that what this is? Yes. <laughs> Nobody told you, did they? No. How are you going to get on? Do you think you'll be all right? I think I'll be all right. I put the hours in, you know, watching X Factor, Pop Idol, Fame Academy, Saturday Night, Chinese. Try not to mention Good The Voice, which is the show that we're on about here. <laughs> I think we've heard of it, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Although your coach is ladies and gentlemen, we're going to get them to turn around and face the other way. You guys have to look at them now, not us. Head on around that way, guys. Yeah, give them a round of applause. Now, this is the bit where we start. Don't think that as an audience member, you've got nothing to do till it comes to the vote. Come on in, folks, if you're just coming in. We've got plenty of seats in here, lots of seats. Come on in. Let's uh, get you in before the singers come out. Uh, now, don't think that you don't have a role in this. You definitely do, because... I will pretty much guarantee you, every person that's going to perform on this stage this evening, bar the band and our backing singers, had no idea this was going to happen this cruise. They booked their cruise through their travel agent, didn't think they were going to be performing in the theatre. Walked up the gangway, didn't think they were going to be performing in the theatre. A little girl at karaoke in the Vista Lounge, and all of a sudden, they found out they're performing in the theatre. So, I'd love it if you were a great audience for them. When they come out, give them a round of applause. Give them a big cheer when they hit that note. And of course, when they finish their performance, I hope you can be a fantastic audience. Do you think you've managed that for us? Yes. Wonderful. Now, I'm never going to introduce any of the singers by name in the off chance that any of these folks have happened to have met them during the cruise. They can't know who the singer is. That's part of the secret. So we will just introduce them by song. We're going to start off with our first song right now. It is Just The Way You Are. Wow! That's what we're going to say with the opening singer tonight. Wow! My 
goodness gracious me, sir. That was a fantastic... Who doesn't love a bit of Billy Joel in their life? You chose perfectly well then for your voice because I think you absolutely smashed that. Wow. Thank you very much. That was great. And I love the look. I love the, the look. It just suits you. It looks great. A mixture of a cowboy and Justin Timberlake. Perfect. That's the, the look we were looking for. Anyway, tell everybody your name and where you're from. My name is Drew Mazzullo. I'm from Great Meadows, New Jersey. Drew from New Jersey! Hey! 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 Which exit? 19 off exit Route 8. Okay, cool. Are we all clear on that? Yeah, yeah. I've got no idea what it means, but every time anybody says they're from Jersey, I always hear somebody go, which exit? So I just Yeah, I'm not kidding. Drew, you, uh, you turn them all on. I don't know if Alfie knows what he was doing, I just think he wanted to hit the big button because he works on the bridge and he's used to pushing buttons. First one round was the beautiful Chelsea coin. She comes from Texas, you know, it's a long way from New Jersey, but hey, let's see if you can understand what she says. Hi, Drew. How are you doing? First, can you explain what is cowboy Justin Timberlake? I get the Justin Timberlake, I don't see the cowboy. Well, white and black usually a lot of cowboys wear white and black, and then the fedora is the Justin Timberlake. Yeah. I like it. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. I turned around straight away because I love the quality of your voice. I love this nice kind of sparkly vibrato that you have. It's really lovely. Great for um. Your earrings are banging against your microphone. Do you know that? Awful. Can you hear that? I'll take it off. Yeah, we love it. This there we go. Oh look, it's I'm a pirate. You are a pirate. Okay, pardon me. So right. um, really vibrato, and you're, it, it was just, I don't know, it was just a great performance. I really liked how you got into it. You were really kind of like bearing down and getting into the, the long notes and the high notes and making it very... Hell not, no, beautifully, I thought. Kind of physical, but singing is really athletic, and I felt like you were getting into that, and I appreciated it. So I would love to be your coach. It was great. Thank you. All right, now we're going to go next to Alfie because Alfie is the next one round. But Gary, try and remember what it was you were going to say. Yes. <laughs> Alfie. I'm not going to lie, I kind of forgot what I was supposed to be doing, so I forgot to push the button. Otherwise, it would have been the first one round. Definitely. Yes. <laughs> and I did turn around. Feel me, love it. Amazing. And you hit every note. It was very impressive. Really enjoyed that. Goody Joel, not easy to sing. Um, yeah, Even yeah, Billy couldn't do it all the time. No, all the time. <laughs> uh, so yeah, Drew, impressed all of them. Thank you. you know, that's the bridge officer. He drives this ship, you know. That's what he does on board. He's a driver. Eh? Impressive, eh? All right, let's go see what the grandpa has to say. No. All right, first things first. Imagine my surprise. I was the last one because I was really enjoying listening to the song. Because listening to your voice, that high voice, I actually thought you were going to be a hot chick. When yeah. I, turned around. Oh. I don't know what to say. And then I turn around, and honestly, you look like my cousin Louie. <laughs> hey, Louie! So I'm thinking to myself, this is perfect. Your upper register is absolutely beautiful, clear. Every single note hit the mark. I want you. I want to be your coach and to sweeten the deal a little bit, I think I would go to Jenkinson's, I get your cheesesteak. It's <laughs> right? You can't say better than a cheesesteak at the shore at Jenkinson's. Jersey boy. He's a Jersey boy as well. Did you tell from the accent? No, not at all. all right. Let's turn around and have a little look at the wall and get you a little reminder of who you're going to go for. It's between Chelsea, Alfie, of Grandpa Gary. You can decide yourself, Drew, or we can use the audience to give you a little bit of assistance. How do you want to go? <laughs> I'm going to go since I live in New Jersey. And I did go to school out in Long Island at Oxford University. I'm going to go with Gary. The grandpa used Jersey to get him on the... Oh, that was like what you did there. You know, he, he's still expecting uh, to for you to take him out, though. Well, absolutely, that, I will. I mean, how it works. I mean, we got a lovely soprano here in the middle, and I thought I was going to be the only soprano on the show. Right. No! <laughs> See what he did there? Coordinated 
his singers to wear black and white this evening. That was a very good touch. Nice to neaten it up there. Very good. He has to just choose one singer. It's not an easy thing, but that's the rules of the show as dictated by The Voice. Both of you are outstanding. The audience love both of you so much so they will show it with how loud they're going to cheer for both of them this season. Give them a cheer, folks. You're But you, dear boy, can only choose one person. This is the hardest thing. It is. The hardest thing of the entire night. And you're both magnificent. I love the choice of songs. Um, and maybe it's an East Coast, West Coast thing. But I don't know how, I, I don't know how to work this year. Oh. But I think I gotta go with Drew on this. Woo! Congratulations, Woo! Drew. Glad well done. You're gonna head over that way with Gary if you want to give him a big round of applause, folks. Drew going through to the final with Gary. Now it's time to welcome over Chelsea with her singer. Give him a round of applause.